You're watching Shoot Your Shot TV, and today is Air Max Day 2024. For Air Max Day 2024, we have the Nike Air Max DN in light crimson and smoke gray. But before we jump into it, we want to give a huge shout out to 1985 Gallery for letting us get a look at these. Now let's go ahead and dive into the details. This is Nike's latest futuristic looking Air Max silhouette, and they feature a seamless upper. They do have a soft padded tongue, and at the top of the mesh tongue, you do have a Air Max DN logo. It's kind of bubbleized, and it looks like it's heat pressed on. They come with black laces pre-laced in, but they also come with an extra set of pink laces and another set of black laces with 3M hits. For the rest of the tongue, you do have this padded pattern that shows in between the laces, and they do have this black piping going around most of the upper. Taking us down to the toe box, you do have this micro mesh material with this rubberized dotted texture throughout. You also do have a rubberized Nike swoosh towards the bottom of the tongue. As you get towards the tip of the toe, you do have a harder plastic piece that looks like it's heat pressed on as well for the mud guard. Taking us to the side panel of the shoe, you have more of that dotted rubberized texture. And then underneath that, you have these other plastic overlays that also look like they're heat pressed on. Underneath that, you do have this plastic stability plate right here. It looks like it could be carbon fiber, but it's more so just a carbon fiber pattern. And it does have this red plastic swoosh as well. Taking us to the back of the shoe, you have more of that rubberized dotted texture. And underneath that, you do have another plastic piece on the heel cup, which has that same carbon fiber print and also has another Air Max DN logo. And then taking us to the midsole, this is where things kind of get crazy. At the forefoot, you do have this polyurethane material in smoke gray, but as you get towards the back, you do see these four air units, which it looks like it could be four individual air units, but as they broke it down, it's just one big air unit with four tubes that feature dual pressure, which react to each step. And taking us to the back of the midsole, it gets real chunky. It looks like it could be tire tread from a tank. It also connects to the outsole. The outsole consists of black and translucent pink. In the midfoot, you do see a rubberized Nike swoosh, and you can also see more of that plastic stability plate. The red piece on the outsole pays tribute to the Air Max Plus, also known as the Air Max Tuned Air. Nike continues to celebrate their annual event, Air Max Day, which commemorates the anniversary of the first Air Max One release, which was March 26, 1987. Over the years, we've seen a handful of new Air Max models, such as the 97-1 by Sean Witherspoon or the Air Max 270. More recently, in 2023, they introduced us to the Nike Air Max Pulse, which is one of my personal favorites in recent years. And for 2024, the Air Max DN, also known as the Air Max Dynamic Air, seems to be all the rave with its futuristic sleek design. They feature that chunky midsole that houses that big tube air unit with the dual pressure that reacts to each step. They say this is the latest and greatest in Air Max technology. However, it's still only meant for athleisure or lifestyle wear, not really meant for sport. Although it is a new Air Max, it does take a lot of DNA from previous Air Maxes like the Air Max Plus or the Air Max Tuned Air, as well as the Air Max Vapor Max. And it's just crazy to see how Nike continues to retool and reimagine technology that they came out with nearly 40 years ago. They just keep finding ways to tinker with it, no pun intended, but they still come out with something good every time. The Air Max DN in light crimson and smoke gray is available today at 1985 Gallery, but if you're not in the area, you can also pick these up on other Nike retailers. They retail for $160. As far as sizing and comfort goes, I definitely recommend going true to size. They're not too narrow. There's a lot of room and give there because of the material that they use for the upper. You can definitely feel that air unit in the back of the heel, but as far as comfort in the forefoot, it is a little lacking. One thing about the Air Max DN, it does have an elevated fit. You're kind of elevated towards the back and then your foot slants and slopes towards the front. And it's something that would probably take some getting used to, but wearing them right out the box, they feel a little awkward, but I know that's something that you could get accustomed to over time. As far as style goes, I really like this silhouette. As I said, it does look like it takes a lot of DNA from previous models and they kind of just mixed and meshed them together. What I really like is that big air unit. I like the colorway that they use on this specific pair. I really like the hits of that light crimson and that translucent pink. It just really goes well with the dark upper. And I know there's a bunch of colors coming out this year. They're gonna just drop color after color. I think these will definitely be a hit.
But how do you guys feel about the Air Max DN? Is it something you've been looking forward to picking up? Or did you go more traditional and pick up the Air Max 186 OG? Sound off in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you guys. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. We appreciate all the support over here at Shoot Your Shot. Let's go ahead and try these on. I'm still sipping on some bubble tea. I'm too cold with this bubble jacket on. Stack the bands and just bubble on the low. Get the racks and just bubble on the low. I need all the bands, I need all the racks. I need all the bands, I need all of that. I need all the bands, I need all the racks. I could fit 10 stacks in the shoulder bag. Now this is C-Rock type beats. I still drink peach green tea with light cheek. I still run game in these 99 threes. You balance doggy, no Balenciaga's on me. Ay! But I might do the raps, used to do the bands, yeah. I need all the stacks, I need all the bands. Get it in advance, feel it in my hands. This is all us, no one ever let the hand. If you enjoyed this review on the Nike Air Max DN, make sure you check out all our other Air Max reviews. We have a bunch for you guys to binge and enjoy. Also hit that like and subscribe button so you can be notified when new episodes drop. We have more coming soon, and we'll catch you on the next one.